It's been such a great time in so many ways since the floods. Grey skies, grey mood. It's just uh, there. Planning this year's big trip, which I'm really looking forward to. I hope to God this weather has stopped doing its thing by then, because last year's big trip was a not really a complete washout, but uh, yeah, it was badly affected by biblical floods. I'm hoping this year's will be better. So yeah, the big trip, uh, I'm going to start off by heading down to Armadale just as a, a good start point um, for the rest of the trip. So nothing too exciting, although it's a lovely ride, going to go down, uh, join on to Waterfall Way eventually, the, the part that isn't destroyed. Go to Arn Armadale, stay at a cabin for a night, and the next day, I've uh, worked out a really great dirt ride, dirt for the vast majority of it, from Armadale to Mount Capitar, where we wanted to go last year but it was raining too much, and where I have been the year before with wifey and loved it. So up there for camping at Dawson Springs campground, where uh, we, we saw the big slug a couple of years ago. There's a giant pink slug lives up there and nowhere else in the world. Very rare. Not many have seen it, but we did. Anyway, I digress. So, after that, I'm going to take off and check out a few places up there that I've wanted to see be on the motorbike and wanted to show you guys. On the way over to Coonabarabran, or are we staying in a caravan park and having the meet-up with the Australian Backroad Touring Group from Facebook. Most of them are staying in the pub, but because I'm going to be on my um, alternate staying in a cabin, staying camping, uh, big trip, I'll be staying in a cabin at Coonabara Brown, just so it allows me to prepare food, etc. for the camping stage of the next next part of it, which will be after a couple of days in Coonabarabran, meeting up with all the guys, checking out the Warren Bungles, I'm going to take off to Cooler Tops, uh, I've forgotten the name of the campground in there, but I'm going to head in there and stay there for one or two nights. Now I'm going to head over towards the coast and then make my way back up to Walka. Down, uh, well, through Nolan Dock, through this great dirt road that I've wanted to ride for a very long time. And after that, I haven't really finished the plan, but uh, possibly go and camp at the beach for a couple of nights and head home, or not sure, still haven't really decided on the whole trip. But uh, greatly looking forward to it, looking forward to making some videos of it sharing it with you guys. Right, just a bit of an addendum to that video. Um, I've been finding it very hard to make videos recently. Uh, obviously you can't get out in the weather, uh, or if you can get out the roads are cut, you can't get anywhere. But uh, just this general feeling of being surrounded by human misery. And you know, going through some of it ourselves, we've been cleaning mold for weeks and we're not even halfway there. It just keeps coming back. Uh, but anyway, while I was editing this video, this more flooded again, another metre and a half over the levee, the town completely flooded again. I can't even find words, people were rebuilding already, uh, what can you do, it's terrible. But what I was trying to get to here is uh, I've got to take the advice I gave myself on the la end of the last video, which is seek happiness wherever you may find it. I've got to do that for myself and part of that is planning this great trip. I hope it will be great. I hope it won't be more of this weather. 
We've got our second sun, sunny day in a row now for the first time in months. It's awesome. They're saying there might be another storm coming. I think we need new weather forecasters. <laughs> but anyway, so see Cabinus wherever you may find it. And another place is here in my garden. I mean, it's where I grow my vegetables. It's where we sit and we have a fire at night and a few drinks. And that's out the back. It's pretty good, isn't it? So yeah, I'm seeking happiness. I'm trying to stay positive. It's not been easy, but I'm doing it. So thanks for watching. Uh, be safe and be happy. Hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers, guys.